welcome back to my my lecture series learning computer with seeing the sites of indian villages or natural natural beauty of indian villages so in the previous lecture we have talked about f dicks or evc dick Uh, coded system that is standard binary coded decimal interchange code uh, which is also called evc dic or ifs dic and we know the and uh, we learn in this code it is possible to represent 256 uh, different characters uh, in this code now in this lecture we will know about the john and pack the decimal numbers and learn how what is john and pack decimal numbers and where it is used so let us start uh, it can be observed that in the ifs dic code or standard binary coded decimal interchange code digit values are same as numeric characters from 0 through 9 or 000 to 1001 however numeric values need some special consideration because we must have a way of indicating whether a number is positive negative or unsigned unsigned implies uh, positive but uh, here it is a special uh, case uh, unsigned represent a another type of positive hmm. hence when the numeric value is represented in ifs dic a sign indicator is used in the zone position of the rightmost digit a sign indicators of hexadecimal c is a plus sign hexadecimal d is a minus sign and hexadecimal f means the number is unsigned now see some illustration which represents the numeric values in c evc dic code note that only zone affected by for see some examples like uh, here is a some examples uh, for example numeric value is 3 4 and is uh, if dic code is f3 f4 f5 and sign indicator f for unsigned uh, in every case we use f for unsigned c for positive and d for negative here for example the numeric value 3 4 5 uh, its its code will be f3 zone only zone so it will be f3 f4 f5 because there is no sign and if we write plus 3 4 5 then it's a uh, mm, uh, fs dic code will be f3 f4 c5 c4 positive and again if we write minus 3 4 5 then it's a uh, mm, it's a uh, fs dic code will be f3 f4 d5 d4 negative so we have to keep in mind that f is used for unsigned c for positive and d for negative you see the some people are working in their field to grow their crops crops now let's discuss this again not that the only zone affected affected sign is the zone of the 
right most digit all other zones remains as f the zone values for numeric characters in fd since each decimal digit has a zone with it numbers coded in abc dic code are called zoned decimal numbers so it is called zoned decimal numbers numeric data input to a computers are usually zoned decimal numbers Printers can print only those numeric characters that are in zone decimal format. Most of the computers cannot perform arithmetic operations on zone decimal data. So, before a computer can perform any arithmetic operation on the data, it must convert it to a format on which arithmetic operations are join the decimal number to a packed decimal number uh, which arithmetic operation are possible and such acceptable acceptable format is the packed decimal format a system uses the following step to convert a join the decimal numbers to a packed decimal numbers so uh, we see here that first we make uh, joined decimal number and then convert it to a packed decimal number and we will learn how to convert it into packed decimal number code the decimal number that is we have used the EVCD code for converting conversion process the here is the step to Convert zone uh, decimal number into pack decimal number. First step is that the zone half and the GD digit half of the rightmost bytes are reversed. This moves the sign to the extreme right of the number. And uh, step two, all remaining zones are dropped out. Uh, now from this above we see uh, some example. For example, we see, let me illustrate the conversion process of John decimal data to pack data. Observe that pack data requires less number of bytes, group of 8 bits, as compared to Gen data. In John format, there is only one digit per byte. In a zoned format, there is only one digit per byte. Each digit along with the zone requires 8 bits. However, there are two digits in each byte in pack format. Each digit requires 4 bits. If the packing process does not completely fill a byte, it fills it with a 0. For example, zone data F3, F4, F5, F6. Uh, which is used for 3, 4, 5, 6, uh, whose numeric value is 3, 4, 5, 6. So when we convert it into joined format, it will be F3, F4, F5, F6. And uh, now we convert it into packed format. This will be 0, 3, 4, 5, 6, F. Again, see some rest on above rule, some example. For example, if we see the numeric value 3, 4, 5, its zoned format is, as discussed earlier, F3, F4, F5. And uh, packed format will be 3, 4, 5, F. Again, for plus 3, 4, 5, its joined format will be F3, F4, C5. C used for positive value, so we write C5. Now, in pack format, we dropped and change the place of 5, and it becomes in packed format 3, 4, 5, C. Again, we see the numeric value minus 3, 4, 5. It becomes 
in zone format as F3, F4, D5. For negative file, we use D. And in packed format, it will be 3, 4, 5, D. So here we learn how to change FSDIC code into joint decimal numbers and packed joint decimal format and joint packed format. Now see if one example to clear it. For example, uh, we have a word bit, 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 and uh, uh, we have to change it. It's uh, in. Uh, we have to write its code in binary and hexadecimal notation. Also, we have to do its uh, EVC decoding. So, first uh, we see its EVC decoding. And with it, we also see the binary and hexadecimal conversion. Both will be like same. Now, B, we know for in binary conversion, B for B we use one one zero 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 one zero and C two is in it's a, a hexadecimal conversion. Again I is I is, I represents uh, by uh, uh, representation of, of I in binary is one one zero zero one zero zero one and uh, in hexadecimal, it is uh, written as C9. Again, T is uh, binary conversion of T is 1110, 0011. And, uh, and its hexadecimal conversion is E3. So, the ABC decoding for the word bit will be 1100. 0, 0, 1, 0. 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1. 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1. Here first from left, uh, first 8 bit is used for B, next 8 bit is used for I and next 8 bit is used for T. Now its hexadecimal conversion will be like uh, in hexadecimal B is represented by C2, I is represented by C9 and T is represented by E3. So its hexadecimal conversion will be C2, C9, E3, C2, C9, E3. Since each character in EVC DIC requires one byte for its representation, and there are three characters in the word BIT, three bytes will be required to store this word using this coding. Same another examples also write minus one two eight as a packed decimal number use hexadecimal how many bytes are required for this presentation solution the minus one two eight as a minus one hundred twenty eight in its abc dick code will be f1 f2 d8 and when he when we change it into packed zone format then it will be one two eight d now each hexadecimal digit requires four bit and there are all together four hexadecimal digit in in this uh, packed format that is one two eight d so therefore four into four about uh, 16 bits are required to represent uh, to uh, store this uh, number or we can say that two bytes because eight bit is equal to one byte so two byte is uh, required for this representation
again see the next example write the a e v c d i c code joined decimal coding for the value plus two five six and use hexadecimal coding how many bytes are required for this presentation first we have to uh, represent two plus two five six into hexadecimal and then we have to convert it into joined or a uh, packed representation here we we can write plus two five six in uh, uh, EVC decode as F two F five C six. Now here each hexadecimal digit requires four bits, and there are all together six hexadecimal digit. Therefore six into four twenty four bits or three bytes will be required for this representation. We may also write directly that since each digit requires one byte for its representation in the EVC DIC zoned decimal coding, and there are three digit in given numbers, three bytes will be required for this representation. Because uh, when we write the packed joined notation of uh, this decimal number, it will be it will be F3, F4, C5, and when it convert into the joined pack, then it will be uh, 3, 4, 5, C. Now next we see the ASCII code or ASCII. Another widely used computer code is the American standard code for information interchange that is ASCII, ASCII. Several American computer manufacturers have adopted ASCII as their computer's internal code. This code is popular in data communication and is used almost ex exclusively to represent data internally in microcomputers and is frequently found in larger computers manufactured by vendors. American National Standards Institute and CANSI, American National Standard Institute ANSI published ASCII standard in 1963. However, however, the standard lacked lower case letters and ANSI subsequently revised in 1967. Later revision in 1968 and 1977 and finally in 1986 brought it in its present form. Today ASCII is one of the most popular and widely supported character in coding standards. And ASCII is of uh, two types ASCII 7 and ASCII 8. ASCII means ASCII American Standard code for information interchange and ASCII 7 is a 7 bit code that can represent 128 that is 2 to the power 7 different characters computer using 8 bit byte or group of 8 bits for 1 byte and the 7 bit ASCII either set the 8th bit leftmost bit of each byte as 0 or use it as a parity bit. ASCII 8 is extended version of ASCII 7. It is a, an 8 bit code that can represent 256 different characters. It adds additional bit to the left of 7th bit 
that is leftmost bit of ASCII 7 code because in ASCII 7 code we use 7 bits now so one code is one one bit is also added in ASCII 7 to make it 8 bit and so it's named is uh, so it is named uh, ASCII 8 now we some example of coding of characters in ASCII 7 and ASCII 8 we here see that ASCII 7 uses only 7 bits the leftmost bit shown uh, leftmost leftmost bit is shaded and is not used in ASCII 7 whereas in ASCII 8 all 8 bits are used hence the code or first 128 character symbols are identical in ASCII 7 and ASCII 8 now see some examples of ASCII 7 and ASCII 8 Now character null. Is ASCII code is if we say ASCII seven, then it will be zero 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 zero, and it's a hexadecimal code is zero. And again, if we say S O H character S O H, so uh, zero 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 one, that is uh, six zero and one one but if you use uh, uh, ASCII 8 code then one zero also is left to the left and there will be seven zero and one one in SOS similarly in null there will be eight zero now STX zero uh, now I am telling this uh, code in ASCII 8 so 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 0 that is 6 0 1 and 0 stx and etx 0 0 6 0 1 1 means uh, we have to place 6 0 and eot 5 0 1 0 0 now enq 4 0 0 1 0 1 sek Four zero five zero one one zero bell B E L five zero one 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 that is three one B B S four zero one three zero S T four zero that is uh, zero 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 and one zero zero one and L F zero 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 one zero one zero vt zero 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 one zero one one ff zero 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 one one zero zero cr zero 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 one one zero one so zero 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 one 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 zero si zero 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 one 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 dle zero zero one zero 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 dc one zero zero one zero zero one similarly we can represent many characters in ascii code some useful characters i saw for exclamation mark uh, will be used as zero zero one zero 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 one and its hexadecimal will be twenty two one similarly has hashtag will be used as uh, 0 1 0 0 0 1 1 2 3 and dollar will be 0 0 1 0 0 1 0 0 and its hexadecimal will be 24 so we have uh, a list of these uh, ascii code we use this as uh, uh, in the given list From this example, we notice from the figure that, or given example, 
ASCII eight code for digits zero to nine are zero zero one one zero 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 thirty one in hexadecimal to zero zero one 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 zero zero one thirty nine in hexadecimal. For uppercase alphabets A to Z are zero one zero 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 one forty one in hexadecimal to zero one zero one one zero one zero five a hexadecimal. And for lowercase alphabets a to Z are zero one one zero zero one sixty one in hexadecimal to zero one 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 zero one zero seven in hexadecimal. The figure also shows ASCII codes for special characters such as plus, minus, underscore, asterisk, uh, slash, dollar percentage, greater than, equal, less than, etc. And non pretemple characters that are always given in figure. ASCII also use hexadecimal as its code to one shortcut notation for memory dump. Example, write the ASCII coding for the word girl in both binary and hexadecimal notation. How many bytes are required to store this word using this code? In ASCII 7, G will be written as 100, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1 in binary and 47, that is 47 in hexadecimal. I is written as 100, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1 in binary and 47. 49 in hexadecimal and R is used as 1010010 in binary and 52 in hexadecimal. Similarly, L will be 1001100 in binary and 4C in hexadecimal.